Hello folks, Fuzzfinger here and welcome back to Lightning Returns. Please remember if you want this series to continue to like this video and show me your support by sharing it with your friends on Facebook and subscribing to the channel as well. Now we're in the middle of the 4-4 quest, or the 4-4 chapter rather, uh, Murals of the Gods, and we've just collected in the previous episode the three tablets from around the dead dunes. Since we're making pretty good time, we've got until the morning now, 6am, to complete this quest. I just want to take a slight detour and collect the fragment of courage that we missed in the previous episode. The final fragment we need for Sassy's quest. So we want to complete in the special match, which is against the Zoltis. And... You do get the fragment for this battle. It is the only way to get the fragment. So it'll be interesting to see how we how we shape up against this guy with our new um, what's it called schema. Because this guy hits fairly hard, it's got to be said. But if we can keep him staggered, then we should be okay. So let's see what happens here, shall we? We'll start off with the usual debuffs, I think. I have to win. So there goes the D-Protect and the D-Shout. Is he going to attack us? Yep, so we'll heavy guard. Uh, right, well apparently he did attack us, but... Not majorly. Ah, there we go. Oh, what's he weak to? He's weak to Blizzard, so we'll start casting Blizzard Art on him now. And it was lovely being able to get that uh, staggering him so quickly. Tears fall into the now we just need to uh, refresh our D-Protect and D-Shell. And go once again for the Heavy Guard. And I think beat down followed by a jump. Ah, uh, we can't do the jump. That was annoying. Yeah, you do need quite a bit of... What's the word? ATB, isn't it? In order to pull off those kind of manoeuvres. But nothing to stop us from pressing ahead with the blizzard there. And now we've got a full bar. We'll guard against that. Get that awesome staggering. And I think this is going quite well, actually, I would say. Yeah, not too bad at all. Right then, let's get those Ds back on him. Guard against the nasty stuff. What's he doing here? Looked like he was doing something. Oh, he is. Tail hammer of some kind. There we go, job done. So yeah, I do like this schema that we've got set up. You just have to be cautious because of the lack of health. Look, 1500 health isn't a lot. Sadly, we don't get any EP from that battle because it was the uh, slaughterhouse. That was a fine performance theory. indeed. I'd welcome a star like you any night. So there's our fragment of courage, and at the start of our next day. We will be heading to Sass first of all to, uh, ha to hand that quest in. Don't sneak up on me. What do you want now? Aren't you worried about Sass? Don't you feel like you've just got to do anything to help him? I'm concerned if that's what you mean. There's my savior. Oh, poor old Sass. He hasn't had anything to smile about in forever. I really want to make him happy again. You know, I stop by his house from time to time to check on him. I don't believe you for a second. As if someone like you would be worried for him. Ouch, that hurts, you know. I've been working my butt off for him. Do you know how hard it was for me to find that coffer of souls for Saz? What kind of gratitude? Tell me the truth. Can that thing really help Dodge? Saz has put all his hope in that box. It would be cruel if that were a lie. Oh, so now you don't think I'm cruel? There we go, look, we found all five of Darji's soul fragments. Light, you've got all five soul fragments you needed to find for Dodge. You should head to Saz's place at once. 
I'd like to think this will help Dodge. But this is Luminum. Yeah, we're not going to head to Sassy's place at once. I hope Ken mind his own bloody business. Uh, instead, we're going to go and finish this quest that we are undertaking. And I'm going to teleport back to the Dead Dunes. And then we will use our cactus, excuse me, our cactuar to proceed from there. Do robots dream? That was, of course, the last side quest we undertook. You should sure know how to make a girl wait, don't you? Let's do this. Just check the map before we go any further. Uh, uh interesting. So I was just wondering where the waypoint marker might be, but can't seem to see one. Not that it matters. I know what I'm doing. Well, I sort of know what I'm doing anyway. So we'll go to the Red Cactuar statue and go to the Sacred Gate destination. And the whole new area of the temple we were exploring has opened up for us now. If you remember the last time we were here we entered uh, the gallery room and unlocked that one section, didn't we, that we hadn't accessed before. Okay. Now, I am going to break these statues because I do still need to fight some, which I know is a little bit annoying as far as uh, watching my walkthrough goes, but because I'm trying to go for as close to 100% as possible, it's very important that we do this. And these unappraised items are always useful to hand in anyway. So make sure you do that. I necessarily won't be doing so on the uh, video. But if you don't know what I'm talking about, you can hand these unappraised items in to the dude, one of the dudes uh, on the second floor at the ruffian's place. You know what I mean. Make sure we're going the right way here. I mean, let's be honest, I've done that before, haven't I gone the wrong way? Let's just stop killing those because it's getting boring for you guys, isn't it? And we'll put that away. Where's all these skeletons? Ah, here we go. Us versus them. And this is more like it. I won't go easy on you. Fight him one at a time. When we was going through the other parts, we were fighting substantially more than one at a time. Uh, just got to remind myself what they're weak to. Nothing, in fact. Okay, Alright, yeah. Let's guard against that for sure. And we got something. A slow level one. Haven't equipped slow on anybody yet. How many more of those skeletons do I need to kill? I know we started on 58 when I picked this quest up. Whether there were skeletons before that point that added to the total, I'm not sure. Or took off from the total. 29. So, yeah, we're exactly halfway through that quest now. And that was all from doing those... Uh, temple... The sort of corridor things that we did to collect the tablets, wasn't it? Oh, right, I've just realised that we've... Hmm. Oh, right, okay, there's the Twilight Gallery, yeah. I just wondered why the map was kind of exploring on us when we've been here before, haven't we? Gotta say, I'm a little bit confused by that. But there's the door that we opened. Right, so that's still open. So at least that's not bugged or anything. So I just thought it was a little bit confusing for me because... Get you. Uh, the map was exploring and we've already been down here. Did not get that at all. I don't like killing those gremlins. I mean, they're harmless really, aren't they? But they're in our way, so they must go. And we've got the waypoint marker, as I said, up in the uh, gallery, the first gallery. 
So we'll see if collecting these tablets has helped us. Oh, that guy snuck up on us. Not very pleasant. Not very pleasant at all. Beat down and jump. Let's stagger him. You're going to be doing that on us? Yes, you are. Okay. Stagger again. So we should be able to finish him off with Blitz quite easily. And we'll examine this. Set the... Uh, what's that? Set the tablet to view the mural. Yes, please. All right, then. Impress me. After all this, these murals better blow me away. Or else I'm going to have some words for you. We used to have this old rhyme, you know. Come, pity poor Etro, she was left all alone. Her blood pouring forth in chaos to atone. Queen of nothing, goddess of death, so let her be known. And then Lindsay, in his wisdom, used the blood that flowed from Etro to give birth to the first humans. Yeah, so we could do his dirty work. Among my people, Lindsay was known as a trickster, never to be trusted. Though, in the end, even our own god was no different. Pulse used us and threw us away all the same. Yeah, I think we've all learned not to trust the gods. At least it gave me the chance to meet you all. But then, after hundreds more years in Crystal, we wake up again. And for what? So Vanille can go mad listening to the cries of the dead? The gods want to make us pawns. But Vanille and me, we're done playing their games. It needs to stop. Vanille and Fang. They once supported Cocoon in their crystal sleep, frozen forever in time. But why did they awake now, at the end of everything? What purpose could God have in doing such a thing? What sort of plan does he have up his sleeve? Right. So we are going to examine the crux body and collect that since it's now appeared. That's a piece of a crux, right? What is this? All we get is some rubbish. Really? It's no rubbish. It's the crux to the sacred gate. Or at least one piece of it. All you have to do is gather all the pieces and put them together. So, two more to go, right? Three seems to be our favorite number. Three murals, three shrines, and now three crux pieces. Okay, so we're going to head to the new area that we unlocked previously. Tablets, right? Go around to each of the galleries. You should be able to see all three. We're going to do what I hope he's telling us to do. Oh, come on. Those things are pretty darn nippy. It's annoying. Yeah, very annoying in all honesty. But let's see what we can do to this guy. Our tears fall into the chaos. Arrow him. Arrow him, I hope. There we go, a couple of staggers and we'll do the trick and then we can blitz him to death. Just like that, that's the plan you see. Oh, one thing I should have done when I was at the slaughterhouse and I forgot was to speak to the woman who gave us the quest to use the nectar. Oh well. There's always next time I suppose, isn't there? Maybe I can just do that at the end if there's enough time before the end of the day. Right, so we're going to head out here. Now this bit gets quite mazy in all honesty. Oh, it's a Kate Sith things. Uh, these things are quite nasty in fact. But we'll see how we get on with it, shall we? They like to heal up if I remember. Does it say what it's... Okay, fire and error, I think that is. Done is done. Yeah, there comes the cure. Very annoying. But we might get another... Come on. Oh man, I was really hoping we'd get another staggering. But it's dead. Oh, 
Oh, we got an achievement, or a trophy rather. Hero of Glory. And what that was for? Probably killing so many monsters or something. Uh, one thing I do want to do is save my game because I haven't done so since the start of this episode, have I? So let's get that done now before we move on. We also saw your sister head out of her. We're going to be going up and around here. Actually, we even got to see the world fall apart. And all Ooh. That thing there, we actually need to kill it. You couldn't imagine how we felt while we just watched It's blocking the way of the well, the way we need to go. So, can we stagger this thing with its shell the usual way? We can. Uh, air is the only thing we want to be casting here. But it's going to use a lot of EP. Wow, that thing was quick to kill. And they were quite challenging when I was trying to face them at... I think it was just now. But we get 2 EP for our trouble. Not too shabby at all. Like a nightmare you could so what I was saying was, uh, there's a few treasures to collect around here. But for now, I'm just going to go the most efficient route. The reason being, we need to try and get this done. And there's plenty of time to return later in order to uh, proceed with any treasures that we miss. And we'll have the cactuar and whatnot to come back to as well. I saw this coming. Now that I'm getting used to this new scheme setup, I'd say it's working quite well. It really is like a rush schema, isn't it? Get it staggered, then get it killed. Just through here, I think there is an item, yep. Yeah. Uh, a collector catalogue. Oh, that's interesting. I wonder what that is. And are we jumping down here? It looks like it. Oh. I didn't particularly want to jump all the way down here, to tell you the truth. Uh, but we're here now, so... I guess we just need to make use of this situation, don't we? Let me just try and get my bearings of where we are exactly. Well, it's not one of these things to kill. I've seen this how it was easy anyway. So there was a couple of treasures I did want to get that we're not going to get from that level now, just because I jumped down a bit too soon. Dream of death. Right, there comes the stagger. These are alright though, you get 2 EP for doing, well, not much work really. Right, so if we follow this path round, I think I know where we are. There should be... Skeleton, yep. Uh, there should be a cactus, or cactuar statue. Just around the side. couple of jumps in succession is always nice, isn't it? Whoa, 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 whoa. Screw that up a little bit. Come on. Oops. Ran out of EP a bit too soon then. Not EP, ATV. The problem with this game is that if you don't play for a while, it does take a little bit getting used to the... Um, what do you call it? Oh, hang on. Oh, right, I've come too far, that's why. It's just down here we want to go. Oh, I'm not going to kill those things. Unless they come chasing after me. If I don't have to, I'm not going to bother. We'll get the door on display. Oh, what's this? Okay, I've got the golden chamber now. So it looks like we only have the one to unlock that we've missed. Right. Now we've got to fight an Earth Eater. Now I don't like fighting Earth Eaters. But there we have it. Um, the only thing actually before we do do that is I just want to see if we can get an item from around here. Yeah we can. A thorn of speed, thank you. Right, so just down here, there's an Earth Eater. There it is, look. 
That's where we need to get, unfortunately. So there's no avoiding this one. I won't go easy on you. Oh, that's nasty. Come on, get him debuffed. What's done is done. Okay, well we can't, so we're gonna have to block again. Right, let's try and get him staggered then if we can. If we can get him to open his mouth, then obviously he'll be weak. What's he is he weak to? Ah, well he's half to everything. It looks like aero. Might be one of the best causes of action there. Gotta try and get these guys staggered. Got to. Um Right, let's guard again. Let's get some arrows going again. And then we'll beat down and a couple of jumps if we can. Can we get another jump in? Oh no, we need to guard against that stuff though. Uh, right, can we de-protect him now? Yes, we can. He's normal against everything now. Let's really try and get him. Staggered again if we can. Yes, we can. Come on, come on, come on, arrow. Oh, this is no good because I've basically run out of everything. Time can't be stopped. Oh, look at his health. It's insane. I say it's insane. Right, oh, God. Because this swallow them whole thing is not nice. As you probably guessed. And we've got no easy way to get rid of his buffs either. Oh no, guard against that. We don't like that. So we might be able to get that staggering now though. There we go. Right, D protect. Come on. And D shell. Let's air him a little bit more. Where did they? D protect and D shell go. I don't know to be honest with you, but. Time to guard again. The darkness embrace you. Oh, I'm just cocking up a little bit here. Right. Guard, guard. Well, I kind of go after Fang for a bit. Yeah, that's what I recommend. He goes after Fang. Right, I don't like the look of this. Glad I guarded in all honesty. We are getting some damage done to him just about. Not a whole lot, but he's down to 50% now, which is nice to see. Ah! Keep guarding on the wrong bloody thing, which is annoying. Right, it's time for a potion of sorts. Uh, go on, we'll use a faith potion. I know it doesn't reduce uh, or give us a whole lot of health back. But anything's better than nothing right now. Oh, come on. Guard, guard, thank you. Right, let's get him staggered. And now let's see if we can get him staggered again. I'd love that if we could. Right, he's weak to physical attacks when he's got his mouth open. So we need to make use of that. Let's guard against that, of course. I think we are getting there. It's just a slog. One more for luck. Yep. Let's get a potion going, I think. It's a hero's potion. Uh, yours? Yes, it does. Let's get that on there. Right then, let's get him down to Lou Health, D Protect I think, and then see if we can finish this guy off pretty soon. Pretty pronto. We're still not there, but we're really not far off now. We're going to have to start guarding again though. Once you get yourself into a routine, it's not too bad, in all honesty. I mean, it's kind of like a boss fight, this Earth Eater. Which is why they're annoying, but hey, that's just the way of it, isn't it? Oh, right, he's staggered. 
in that case then we'll get a deep attack on him. One of those, one of those, another one of those, and then some attacks. We won't finish him up I don't think, but he's going to be pretty darn low. Uh, let's get a potion. And a guard, a guard, wouldn't guard, because we ran out of EP. Good job we got that potion on really, wasn't it? So you're going to have a bit of a problem here. Let's bring that EP up on the guard. Can we get him staggered, please? Really appreciate that. Right, there's the stagger. There's the deep protect. And let's just see if we can blitz him to death. Yes, we can. Good job, Lightning. Good job. D Bravegar, level 1. And a Desert Rose. Maybe we can go and hand that in for a gold chocobo. Right, I think now would be a good opportunity just to head back to grab some potions. Now we've unlocked the Cactuar, we can do. Uh, I'm going to finish the episode here, folks, and that'll be a good point as any. So please join me next time where hopefully we're definitely going to be getting this quest finished. Until then, don't forget to like the video if it's been helpful to you, and I'll see you next time for more Lightning Returns. Bye, everyone.